So today, city leaders gathering in Mira Mesa to flip the switch on a new smart stoplight system. 10 News anchor Jim Patton joining us live from Mira Mesa Boulevard in Mira Mesa. Jim, this road is certainly a difficult one, but anything that can help traffic is what people want to hear. Yeah, this particular boulevard, you're talking 50,000 cars a day, and it backs up a lot, so it needs these lights as much as many in San Diego. And I just wanted to show you, we talked about how we would see flipping of the switch. Well, that happened, and this is what switch was flipped. Basically, you have a computer here, and it was flipped over to allow adaptive. And what it means by that is, this intersection right here on Mira Mesa Boulevard at Reagan Road, if you look up there at the top of the light, you'll see there's a camera that's been installed on the light apparatus. That camera reads the flow of traffic coming from one side or the other, and then it allows the light to adapt to that traffic for maximum efficiency. What that will mean is during peak periods, if you are on the main Mira Mesa Boulevard, you'll be getting by faster than you normally would with the old lights. But it also means if you're trying to cross Mira Mesa Boulevard during a peak period, you may have to wait a little longer. Basically, it's a system that allows for the greatest efficiency among the greatest number of people. The plan is it now extends uh, almost to the freeway. The plan is to later extend it all the way to the freeway. Other areas getting attention around the city are in Mission Valley, as well as Point Loma, and just all heavily congested areas around San Diego. Reporting live in Mira Mesa with the Smart Light Traffic System, Jim Patton, 10 News.